Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of you, wherever you are, in what time zone. A warm welcome to the official opening of Moderna's interview 2021. As much as we would have preferred meeting you in person, we have worked out the next best alternative. During the next 15 minutes, we will learn, show you how uh, we will pass the next four days and we will show some insights and topics and we would like to discuss them with you. So feel free to drop your comments, ideas in the section below. We would love uh, to learn your ideas on the three topics of today. One is, we'd love to know how are you doing? Secondly, we'd like to share with you why we are confident that Moderna is well prepared for the future. And lastly, um, we have some uh, interesting shout out, new hashtag we are launching, hashtag plastic is fantastic. So it's still somewhat a digital version, but also interactive because we are uh, more than excited and curious to get your feedback in the comment section. Good morning, my name is Caroline, member of the sales team at Moderna. It has been a challenging year, but also a year where we have discovered new ways of communication, such as video calls by Teams or Zoom. In the meantime, it's my pleasure to introduce you to a new member of our team who joined us a few months ago, namely Thibault Stevens. Thank you, Caroline. Hello, I'm proud to be part of the Moderna family and join the TED industry. Hopefully, we will see each other soon. Enjoy the digital Moderna interview fair, and let me introduce my new colleague, Claire Verhelst. Hi, my name is Claire and I joined the team at the very beginning of this year. I am passionate about pets, so I feel at the right place. It makes me a happy person when I can share my enthusiasm and positivity with my colleagues and customers. I have experienced a warm welcome and thanks to the help of everybody, I feel I was able to quickly take some tasks of my very busy colleagues, like for example, my mentor, Hilary. Thank you, Claire. Hi, I'm Hilary, the internal sales manager. During the COVID period, we've learned the value of small things, and we do appreciate more than ever our partnership with you. The entire team did their utmost to keep the flow going, and we will continue to do this in the future together with you. One of our challenges is to deliver your products on time. My colleague, Philip, always tried to find out the best logistic solutions for you. Indeed, Hilary. Hi, my name is Philip. Besides internal sales, I'm responsible for logistics within our company. As Hilary mentioned, uh, this last year we faced a lot of problems, unexpected problems, and nowadays uh, logistics and supply chain seems to be the biggest problem, especially overseas shipments are affected by high, pr high prices and uh, limited capacity. But no matter what, the entire Moderna team is here for you. We are ready to help whenever, wherever. Great, thank you team. Uh, these were some very valuable insights. So now discussing also trade shows because today is the official opening of Interzoo 2021. How do you envision the future of trade shows? Um, I refer to my recent interview with the Zoomark team. They are preparing for organizing the first physical gathering of the pet industry in Europe. And that's gonna take place end of this year uh, in Bologna. So, how do you see that? How, what's your idea on this? Because we came to the conclusion that pre-COVID, we were kind of fed up with trade shows in their original form. They were too expensive. There were too many of them and they were absolutely not sustainable. So um, the more we were kind of fed up with them then, the more we kind of miss them today. Do you agree? We'd love to know. So shoot us your comments in the section below. All right, next. Uh, why do we confidently claim that Moderna is well prepared for the future? Do you agree? Uh, do you feel confident the same way? And uh, where, do you know where Moderna wants to go? And I know that when I say go, it sounds very attractive. So maybe in the meantime, for you shooting your comments, this is a good question for Bart. Bart, why do you feel confident that Moderna is well prepared for the future? Well, I believe we are ready for the future. And first of all, I would like to mention that, uh, as you all know, the pet industry has seen a tremendous growth over the last year. Uh, we at Moderna, we also have seen a lot of demand growing. So especially Belgium, we've seen 30% of growth. Um, in the US, we've nearly doubled. 
Um, so we've had to react, and yes, we have done so. We have reacted, we have put new machinery, added machinery in Belgium. Uh, we've doubled capacity in the US, where we've added seven all-electric injection molding machines. So uh, it was a challenge during these uh, busy, busy times to add all that capacity. So that's a good time to thank the team that has worked with us to accomplish all that. Uh, a warm thank you. Also, a thank you to all the partners and everybody uh, who has worked with us to get through that uh, because it was challenging, but I think we've managed pretty good. So I believe we are ready. A uh, big challenge was getting raw materials. As you all know, there is shortage. And um, at this point, besides the prices being sky high, it's availability that is crucial. Uh, we have long-term relationships with our suppliers. So that means that we've had uh, a good flow of material and we've been able to keep our production running we've been able to keep on supplying you most of the time. Um, recycled material is a different story, it's a little more difficult, uh, but again there we have long-term relationships with our recycling companies and we are working to enforce that even more. Um, so the team has done a great job. Also the team from R&D has been working very hard over the last year. We have not been sitting still and there's a lot of new products in the pipeline. We are happy to share them very soon with you. And I think that Zoomark uh, in the fall will be a good time to show them live uh, to you. And last but not least, to be ready for the future, I'm proud to announce that Moderna is building a complete new factory in Belgium. And that factory is very close to our actual factory here. So the whole team can stay, they can all stay on board, which is good. And uh, the new factory will really be um, something different. We are building um, a factory that has a double of the capacity. So we will have more machines. And then we also have the high bay automated warehouse that will have uh, 12,500 pallet places, it's 40 meters high, and uh, that should increase the service level with our uh, customers, which is good. Also, we will have new offices there with flexible workspaces, nice environment, so everybody can feel welcome there, and the great team can keep going. And of course, we will make it as sustainable as possible and do it uh, energy efficient with solar panels, with electric machinery, with uh, everything we can do to reduce our carbon footprint. All right. So yes, I think we are ready. All right, thank you, Bart. I guess this uh, has a nice uh, confidence message to uh, our audience. So are you all ready for a somewhat shocking quote we are launching, plastic is fantastic? Uh, when working on our sustainability roadmap, we came to the conclusion that plastic is truly a fantastic material. Uh, it's lightweight. It's 100% recyclable, and uh, thanks to its diverse properties, it has an unlimited ways of transforming. It was also the basis of our Moderna Green Pact, where we focus on betterness, and we envision the four R's that keep us focused on doing the right things. So if you want to learn more about our sustainability roadmap or plans, click on the link below uh, to go to our website, and you will find everything on the Green Pact um, uh, page. Plastic is fantastic. We only see two major issues here that should be dealt with in the short term. One of them is the use of single use items. Um, it's unjustifiable that people are creating products for using sometimes maybe just seconds before they become totally useless right afterwards, but they remain a burden for society for decades and sometimes centuries. So single use products, we need to get rid of them. The second challenge is the availability of recycled material. It's uncomprehensible. We cannot lay our hands on enough material as we would like, because um, the stream of recyclable products or recyclable material today is somewhat sold and shipped halfway through the world where it's uh, eventually dumped instead of being upgraded back into the value chain. We have set our own goal for 2021 where we want to replace 35% of our annual raw uh, material volume by recycled material. So I invite 
all the stakeholders in the value chain to reinvent themselves because we are ready to replace even more. Our big goal is by 2030, replacing 98% of that volume. So uh, we would like to do that with everybody in the chain. And if we stay focused and we get those challenges out of the way, we will come to the conclusion plastic is truly fantastic. All right, time for some ribbon cutting ceremony. Uh, let's finally pass to the official moment where we can declare Moderna at Interzoo officially opened. All right, Bart, we invite you to cut that ribbon and yay! 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 We are well aware of the fact that this is not the traditional, usual Moderna booth atmosphere. But with that awareness in mind, we have created a fun alternative. I hope you have booked your 30 minute session with your usual Moderna contacts, because without revealing too much, we have a present for you. And we will also showcasing um, in Premiere our first blog. So don't miss it. Click on the link below to secure your post if you haven't done so so far. We had fun doing this. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe so you can stay uh, tuned for more. And we look forward to meeting you in one of those sessions during the next couple of days. In the meantime, bye! bye. 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 <laughs>